How many times have you come up with an excuse not to work out? Well, no more, because all you need to do this workout is 18 minutes of your life. I know you have 18 minutes. You're watching Netflix, come on. And your body, you don't need any equipment. You can do this in your living room. You can do it in your basement, in your garage, in your backyard. That's all you need. Today I'm gonna to walk you through a Tabata workout. So what Tabata is, is a certain amount of time and a certain amount of rest. So you're going to do 20 seconds of work followed by 10 seconds of rest and you're gonna move through six different movements. And this is gonna be five rounds. Easy peasy. But here's the kicker. Are you ready for it? Your rest is gonna actually be holding a plank. Gotcha. So let's go through all these movements. First, we're gonna start off with a burpee pop. So you're doing 20 seconds of burpee pops. I made up that name. I completely pulled it out of my ass, but that's what it is. So you're going to go down into a plank position and instead of jumping straight up like a normal burpee, you're gonna kick your knees towards your chest and then the feet are going back out into your plank position and then you're jumping up. Burpee pop. Next are 180 squat jumps. You're gonna go into a squat, then you're gonna jump, then as soon as you land, you're gonna turn 180 degrees, you're gonna jump and do the exact same thing. Next we have plank jack shoulder taps. Say that 10 times fast. When you're in your plank position, once you jump your feet out, you're going to shoulder tap with your right hand. Then once you bring your feet back in, hand goes to the ground, feet back out, left hand touches that right shoulder plank jack shoulder taps. Now we're gonna spike that heart rate up with these runner taps into a jumping lunge. So the left foot is forward, right leg is back, that left knee is stacked right on top of the ankle. We're gonna bring that right leg forward into five taps. Once we hit that fifth tap, we're gonna do a jumping lunge and so that right leg is forward and then we do the same thing on the next side. Now this movement is awesome. It is going to be a broad jump into a reverse bear crawl. Now you're gonna broad jump as far as you can. You're gonna land soft on those heels. Then as soon as you land, you're gonna plant those hands on the ground and you're gonna reverse bear crawl to your starting position. As soon as you get back to where you started, broad jump, hands down, reverse bear crawl back. Now last but not least, let's work on those abs. We're gonna do crab stance toe taps. Now once you sit back on those hands, you're gonna always touch the opposite hand to opposite leg. So that right hand is going to touch your left foot, keeping your hips elevated as much as possible. Then your left hand is going to touch that right foot, alternating between each side for 20 seconds. Now let's walk you through this 18 minute workout. Remember, it's a Tabata workout, so it's 20 seconds of work followed by 10 seconds of rest. But instead of resting, because you're no weak bitch, you're gonna hold a plank for your 10 seconds of rest. So what it's gonna look like is five rounds, you're gonna do 20 seconds of your burpee pops followed by 10 seconds of a plank. Then you're gonna do 20 seconds of 180 squat jumps followed by a 10 second plank. Then 20 seconds of plank jack shoulder taps followed by a 10 second plank. Five runner's taps into one jumping lunge for 20 seconds followed by a 10 second plank. Then 20 seconds of your broad jump into a reverse bear crawl, 10 second plank. And then 20 seconds of your crab toe taps followed by 10 seconds of rest. You're gonna do that five rounds, 18 minutes, you're out the door, sweaty and disgusting and beautiful. You're gonna feel so good tomorrow and be so glad that you didn't create another excuse to work out. Go try this workout out. Let me know what you think on Instagram. I can't wait to hear from you.